So, welcome back. We are asked to find the length of arc DFE if a circle is inscribed in this equilateral triangle. So, let's start. That is a major arc. So, the first thing I will do, I will add an auxiliary line, two auxiliary lines. So, I've added it. Okay, that's the first thing. And we know that the radius this is now the radius of this circle. Let's call it R. And we know that radius and tangent line are related, they are perpendicular. So the sides are like tangent, are like tangent line to the circle. So this should be angle 90, angle 90. This is also 90. So, and the total is an, is an equilateral triangle, meaning this interior angle is 60, 66. So, we now have a quadrilateral A, E, O, D. And we know it's a polygon. The sum of the interior angle of any polygon is N minus... 2 times 1, 8, and since it's 4, so the sum is 4, 4 minus 2 that th times 1, 8 is 360. So if you sum this, 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 and this, the remaining angle here, it should be 360. So if this is 90, 90, 180, this should be 120 to make it one, on, that's 180 plus 180, 360. So that's it. But we are asked to find arc DFE. So the, the major arc, we are looking for this angle. So since this is 120, this is 240. Angle at a point is 360. So we are good to go. So we have that. They will write everything. The first thing that angle angle b a c 60 degrees based on equilateral triangle theorem interior angles are all 60 degrees and ang angle the angle o e o e a is 90 degree based on radius tangent relationship so they're always perpendicular so the same as that angle o d a also 90 based on that same theorem which implies that the angle D, angle D O E, that is for the minor arc. Angle D O E is 120 based on interior angle sum of a polygon. Fair a polygon so and the angle this angle d o that is the major arc that's for the major arc is two fourth angle at a point so finally we're asked to find the length of arc d f so length of arc arc dfe is now equal to theta over 360 our angle is 240 over 360 times 2 pi r um, but there is a little problem here we need to get the value of r 
And how do you get it? If you notice, we are given this chord, length of chord, chord DE. So we we'll remember length of chord. The le formula for length of chord is so 3.5 is equal to length of chord is 2R sine half theta. That's our theta. The angle here is 120. So 120 over 2. That's a formula for length of chord. And this is 60. So we have root 2R sine 60 is root 3 over 2. So remember this formula has 2R. So we'll get 2R from here. So solving for solving for 2R Three point five is seven over two. So seven over two, the two two. So we are left with seven over root three. So that is our diameter. Two R is diameter. So we replace it with that. So but then let's cancel out. The zero zero. Okay, twelve in twenty four is two. Twelve in that is. 3 times our pi. Pi is 22 over 7. And our 2R. 2R is 7 over root 3. So we have 7, 7. So we have 40. 2 times that 44 over 3 root 3. Or we can rationalize as 44 over root 3 over 9. So that is our answer. Okay, that is the answer. Either you leave it or you rationalize. Thank you.